So now we're into rolling back or rolling like a ball. So each of you, let's Let's get into a little bit of transitioning if you're going into the traditional mat. So before this, we did the one leg circle. So lie back down. Good. And then I want you, without even thinking about it, roll yourself up, grab onto your ankles, and roll into your little ball position. So Emily, grab onto your ankles. You want to hold your ankles. I want the knees apart so they're right at your shoulders and pull the heels towards your glute. As you do this, don't roll back yet. I want you to just think you're rolling your whole body into a as tight of a little ball as you possibly can. And think about a little push and a pull with the legs and the hands, which makes you even round deeper. Looking towards your abdominals, towards your thighs, knees open, yep. Yeah. Now, from here, try to keep the distance between the heels and the glute the same. And I want you to inhale and just roll back onto your shoulders, not your head, and back up and down. Inhale, exhale. Good. And inhale as you roll back. And you're just trying to not roll onto your head and neck, but roll where you can and then roll back up. Finding that balance point, keep the push and the pull looking towards your body the entire time. Don't look at the ceiling. Someone look at the ceiling and try to get back up. Yeah, well, <laughs> roll back, look at the ceiling. Yeah, well, you're just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> so keep looking rounded into the belly as you go. So that's basically rolling back or rolling like a ball. Um, the thing is, when you roll back, is just watching that A, you don't look up towards the ceiling or let those legs become like a little kick as you go. And that's rolling like.